Avengers Infinity War is quite possibly the most anticipated movie of all time, which means I will not spoil it in this video. Uh, I'll just get that right out of the way, no spoilers here, I'll have a spoiler review for that, because uh, there's, there's a lot to talk about, a lot to talk about, uh, I wouldn't even know where to start if I wanted to do spoilers, uh, so I'll save that for another day, where I can actually kind of focus more. But right now we're just going to talk about the movie itself. There isn't much to talk about without spoiling anything. So to keep it vague, uh, Thanos uh, needs the Infinity Stones to wipe out half the universe. The Avengers got to stop him from doing that. There you go. That's all you need to know for the plot. Uh, that's all I'm going to tell you. And yeah, that, that, there's the review. <laughs> I can't say much, really. Uh, this is a great movie. I love this movie. I didn't. I don't think it's the best of the MCU. I think because it doesn't feel like a whole story, because it's not, um, it doesn't rank up with like my top three. It might be like my number four or five uh, in the MCU because this is a great movie. It is really great. I had a great time with it. Uh, I think it has some problems. We'll get to that in a second. Um, there's a lot to digest in this movie. There's so many things to spoil. I'm not going to do that. Uh, but... Yeah, a lot of happens in this movie, and that can kind of lean into some of my problems, which we'll get to in a minute. But for what I can talk about, uh, the characters are all fantastic. They're the best part of this movie. I love watching all of them. No, I was never bored. Uh, there's times where you could fill the run the runtime because it is a long movie. There's times where you could fill the runtime, but it's not in a bad way. You feel like you were really experiencing this movie and you're along for the ride even if you can feel a lot of it going by uh, so I don't really consider that a problem it does take its time uh, but it's not like a boring movie by any means it's very exciting for the most part there's ha stuff happening every second this movie's chock full of stuff happening so much happens in this movie it's I have to keep this very vague but the actions very good the humor is very good the characters are all fantastic here uh, there's a character decision or two that may be out of, a little out of character, but nothing really big. No, no real big problem I have with that. Uh, Thanos is fantastic. He's possibly the best villain we've had so far. Uh, he is menacing. You not necessarily feel for him, but you understand where he's coming from. He's quite possibly the best villain we've gotten so far, because there is a lot of development with Thanos in this movie, and everything that has been built up to now was well worth it. This is well worth the wait. I love how all these stories like come together now. But it can feel a little a little like it lacks substance. It doesn't have the substance of a movie like, say, Civil War did. Because that was a more focused and contained story than Infinity War. Infinity War is a bunch of different plot lines converging. And it can feel like it lacks substance at times. Because it is trying to get all these characters together. It is trying to get you to... Uh, feel for all these characters to kind of establish where they are and to get them together and It can feel a little like it lacks substance. It's not a really big problem because it doesn't Really bother me too much, but for that reason you may not be able to rewatch this movie as much as say Civil War or Spider-Man Homecoming or Guardians of the Galaxy or something like that uh, I didn't have really have a problem with that necessarily But it is kind of an issue with the movie because it does feel like it does lack substance compared to some of the other movies which, in some regard, makes it fall in comparison, or pale in comparison. I shouldn't say pale in comparison, because this is a really great movie, don't get me wrong. As I said, the characters are fantastic. I love how everyone converges in this movie. I love the team-ups we get in this movie from different people. I'm not going to say who exactly. Uh, but I love the ending. The ending's fantastic. It definitely leaves you wanting more. Which can kind of be a problem, but I shouldn't complain, because if I want more, the movie did its job. So, in that regard, it's fantastic. Um, yeah, the ending does leave a little bit to be desired, but that's the intention, and considering that it succeeded in that intention, then I can't complain, really. Uh, it's just a personal thing. Um, a lot of my fan theories came correct. A lot of them did not. A lot of them did not. Uh, just leave it at that. But we'll get to more of that in the spoiler video. I had to keep this really vague. There's not much I can say. Performances are all top-notch. The chemistry is fantastic. Humor is great. Uh, the action's perfect. Um, the drama is very well done. There, I never cried, 
because that's one problem with this movie. This movie's exhausting. It never lets go. Once you get going in that first scene, it kicks it right off. So there's no time to breathe, which can be a little bit of a problem in the end. Not a huge problem, but a problem nonetheless. Because, uh, yeah, this movie never stops. Uh, which, for some scenes, can feel a little disappointing in a way, because there are things that happen in this movie that do need some time to really sink in, and they don't really give you that time. But what the Russos had to do with this movie was something amazing, and what they pulled off was really great. Uh, they had to get all these stories in, make them make sense, make them all come together, and they did that very, very well. So I'm going to give Avengers Infinity War a A-. minus. Um, this is a great movie. It is one of the best movies of the year so far, if not the best. Uh, this and Love, Simon are probably my favorite movies of the year. Um, this is a really great movie. Like, I, I, this is coming from a fan, yes, but I really do think this is a great movie, and I think once we see the fourth Avengers movie, we're going to feel a lot more strong about this one. I think this one's going to have a lot more impact. Uh, it definitely has a lot of impact. There's definitely a feeling of hopelessness by the end of it, which is really, uh, indifferent for the MCU, but very refreshing. So yeah, that's my review for Avengers Infinity War. I'll have a spoiler review up soon. Sorry I haven't been uploading in a couple weeks. I saw Rampage. I never reviewed it. Liked it. But uh, a lot of stuff's been happening. So yeah. But yeah, so that's my review for Avengers Infinity War. So peace.